Hi, welcome to another video. I would like to show you the raw files of the images that I've taken today. And with, uh, I added a polarizer filter to my camera lens today. So I'm going to show you the different effects a polarizer does to your images. So I I took a few. It was a mixed day uh, today. So we got some beautiful clouds. Got some beautiful blue skies, and we also have some dark shadows in a few parts I was trying to take different images to what I not normally I don't particularly want to take the same image all the time so I try and do images different so i've selected a few images i'm going to show you the raw file then next week i will show you them when they've been edited so at the moment i'm showing you a picture of a beautiful calm sea and the lighthouse in the background with some clouds more or less being lit up by, by the sun the third image i thought was quite good because you've got the reflection on the sand of the sea you've got the two lighthouses in the background and the sky is reflecting on the sea and also on the beach similar image you've got more cloud cover which gives you more details in the clouds and it's a similar image as the last one but you've got a lot more brighter uh, happening in, in the sky Again, it's a different image, but this time you've got the full beach in and also the lighthouses in the background and the reflections of the sky and the clouds reflecting on the beach. A similar image, but you've got more water on the beach reflecting from the sea gives you that reflection of the sky and if you notice in the far corner the sky is more bluer than it is in the foreground that's well burnt out as you can see i was trying different angles with the clouds coming across and you can see more closer that the blue near the lighthouse is more of a lighter blue uh, trying different angles of the images a closer one of the wet beach in the foreground and the Ice houses in the background with clouds coming closer towards you. Here we have on the opposite side is Sands End and the clouds are coming in more thicker and darker. And here's another image of 
more or less the same location but the sky is a lot darker in some areas and lighter in the middle bits as you can see there the sky is so interchangeable that we have cloud cover and a slight reflection on the beach now and the sun is lighting those waves up and the lighthouse is in the background. I did a portrait one of just purely of the lighthouse's reflection. Similar one with more cloud cover. I was trying to get a closer one of the lighthouses and a few of the waves to make it more seaside -y. A beautiful image of the light, sorry, of the Abbey and St Mary's Church. And trying to get the sun reflecting on there too. And there's some cloud cover as well. Another one of the St Mary's Church. Trying to get different angles and trying to reflect the sun on the church and the sand and on the rooftops a similar image but not as close i was trying to get the capturing the sun on the wooden pier and there's trying to Capture the golden sun reflecting on the wooden beams. Trying to get some dark shadows on the lighthouses opposite each other. A similar thing, trying different settings and working out which is the best one. So you'll see a few of them. Trying different angles on the red box that's in focus now. As you can see, the reflection of the railings in the foreground and the sky is also changing and there's no clouds in sight. A beautiful sunset there over Sands End with some cloud cover. A similar type of image. Trying different angles. There you go. There you are. My photos I've taken today. These are the raw files that I'm showing you. Please like, comment and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you in next week's video. Bye for now.